Israel's aggression seems to be getting worse and worse. As I previously stated, the ICJ basically gave them a green light to do whatever they want with Gaza, as this has been the precedent before. Israel commits aggression, Palestinians respond. In retaliation, they massacre villages and form new settlements there. And this has been a precedent for 75 years now. Usually what Israel gets is a mere warning or scolding by US or UN, depending on which part of history we discuss. Like just now recently, what the ICJ's decision was, was basically a scolding for Israel that they are to prevent a genocide from occurring in Gaza. Since real measures, provisional measures would require more physical rather than verbal action, Zionists can basically do whatever they want now. And worry about any consequences that they suffer later. The aggression in West Bank seems to be only getting worse and worse as days go by. They are punishing the Palestinians in the West Bank for what Hamas did on October the 7th. And then finally you have Gaza. Most of northern central Gaza has been bulldozed to the ground with planning made for new settlements to be made there. And as IDF are finishing up with Khan Yunus, they are moving more and more into eastern Rafa, the last refuge of the Palestinians, which is only growing smaller and smaller day by day. Eventually they will be forced to move into to the Sinai Desert as they have literally no place to go. To make things worse for the Palestinians, they are blocking humanitarian aid from entering into Gaza. Just recently, the Israeli Navy had shot a UNRWA truck which was providing the last bit of humanitarian relief they could provide the Palestinians as the Western nations, the EU and the US have completely defunded UNRWA. I wish to end on a positive note but the things are looking dire, very very much so. We are not the pagan aboriginals nor are we native americans victory is only in the hands of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we will fight we will be patient and we will prevail for allies with the patient inshallah